Wanna turn Gmod from this to this? Or maybe this? I got you. First, head down to the link below and open my collection. Hit subscribe and let everything install. Click play, load the game and you're done. That's, that's it, the video over, done, we're done here. We can fix this. I'm breaking this video down into settings, weapons, maps, and the last step, which is most important, so stick to the end. The four main add-ons to go through are Sharp Eye, View Mod, Life Mod, and Shmovement, as well as some important extras. Starting with Sharp Eye, feel free to pause and copy my settings. Make sure to disable all view bombing as it interferes with Shmovement. These settings control your aiming, they help a lot in achieving that unrecord arm move. Unrecord doesn't give you a crosshair, so turn these all down to zero. Also, click this or view mod won't work. View mod moves your arms to change your camera view, although I don't actually use it. Movement adds bobbing, swaying and rolling to give you a realistic camera movement, but it's sensitive, so keep it low or copy my settings. On to life mod now, there are a lot of settings so I'll just show mine. In basics I only use colour modification and bloom, motion blur, sunbeams and sharpen. With textures, I really only use uncompressed textures. To remove the random NPCs, go to the options menu, then general and disable. Holding B zooms in by the way. The only utilities that change are base speeds, I go for these settings. If you want to kick shit, type this into your console and hit the assigned key. Clean like a Rainbow Six Siege sweat, type this into your console. Now, we're looking good, but for that real on record look, you need to stick to the end to get the fisheye lens and vignette effects that pull the look together. Also, if you guys would like to see more videos in this style, let me know. And would you like to see unrecord horror videos? My collection adds a ton of guns to copy the shooting in unrecord. Bad guns really ruin the effect, so listen up. Navigate to the weapons tab, and then to modern warfare. Unrecord uses pistols, so they'll be the focus. Pressing C will open a customization menu where you can turn your gun into any monstrosity possible. And this is how you save your customizations. So, now you have your guns, but what about your player model? Hold C and navigate to the top right. The hands are the important part, but choose a military style player model like mine, then navigate to the hands tab. You can use any hands you want, but I recommend using the dedicated hand models like these. Just be careful of this bug, you need to reselect your main player model to fix. Map selection can make or break the realism of your game. Bad maps like this can ruin the immersion needed to replicate Unrecord. But if this is a bad map, what's a good one? Luckily for you, all the amazing maps you're about to see are in my collection, so enjoy.
And now for the most important part of the video, that'll turn Gmod from this... ...to this. You get the idea. Reshade. This is the single most important step, but it has to be done right or your game will look terrible. So how do you avoid that? I'm not just going to give you a link and leave, nah. I'm going to give you the presets you need and walk you through them. But first, I want to quickly go over some potential issues that weren't covered earlier. Some maps will have these errors, it depends on what games you have mounted. When killing NPCs, blood sprays everywhere. But the long trails can bug out in the dark. This is the mod if you want to remove it. Also, this mod can bug out, so disable if it does. These error messages can flood your console. I haven't seen any issues, but just be aware. If NPCs glow after death, disable this setting. And if you have a weird night vision goggle problem, turn all these off. Now, reshade. Head down to the second link below now and open reshade. Scroll to the bottom of the page and hit download. Go to the top right of the screen and open file location. Then just open reshade. Click browse and find gmod at roughly this file path. I already have reshade so I can't show this part properly, but here's my interpretation. Just check all the boxes, click through all the pages, and hit finish. Open Gmod and you'll see a new banner across the top of the screen. Load a map of your choice and hit the home key to open reshade. This is what you'll see after opening with the preset menu shown here. These are all the shaders I use, but just copying isn't enough as each shader has unique settings. Don't worry though, I'll show you exactly how I get this look. Starting from top to bottom, first we have Perfect Perspective, which gives you the fisheye lens effect. Following that is TAA, and then Tone Map, which changes your light levels. Onto Eye Adaptation now, which lets you see better in the dark. This Bloom Filter gives you Bloom. This Bloom Shader also adds Bloom. You fucking idiot. This does something important. Artistic vignette is really important since it frames the lens effect that makes Unrecord look realistic. But Unrecord has this shit! And you don't! Get fucked. This is another colour grading shader. And HDR gives you a higher range of shadow and brightness. Colour Lab is another colour grader. Technicolor is also another colour grader. And finally, Unreal Lens gives you nice lens flare effects that tie it all together. And we're done. Obviously, pause and copy everything at your own pace. If you reach this point in the video, comment what kind of Gmod videos you want to see next. Oh, and like. Like and subscribe. Yeah, do like and subscribe. Do that. Do, do both of those things. Like and subscribe. Bye!